We have a ROM available for the Mi 12 device users called Cherish Wills, which is based on Android 12 L or you can say Android 12.1 March security patch and this is what we have right now. The ROM seems to be quite good, good performance, good Geekbench score. You have the MIUI camera pre-installed and a lot more things. So let's get started. Let's find out some things which you get in this one called Cherish OS. Of course, the ROM with some bit of customizations, good UI, some pixel props and a lot more things. I think so might be a good choice for you if you want to try something different here. Let's move on to the default things here. Um, the default launcher as expected is the Pixel Launcher. Android 12.1 goodies available. Quick wallpapers which looks quite interesting of course. I try to enable some different wallpapers here and it was working perfectly fine we have the pixel launcher pre-installed as expectedly and google apps are already included don't need to install google apps separately for that so yes might be a positive thing for you if you think about these things this is what we have as a default launcher if i move on to the quick settings panel of course the new animations are there looks quite interesting by the way in android 12.1 i i found animations are more smooth more good if you compare it with the normal android 12 version it has the android 12 easter egg only it's but still it's based on android 12.1 or 12 l if you want to talk about if you move on and check out the app opening app closing animation speed etc it's good enough it's actually good enough it will not give you any kind of lags or slowness things looks quite good this is what you have as app opening and app closing and quite interesting by the way that you have the octavio styler pre-installed in place of the google phone or google app google phone dialer app we have the octavio OS dialer which is basically a themed version of aos p1 which looks like the oxygen os dialer and actually a lot of users love these things and this is what you have pre-installed looks quite interesting if i move on to the geekbench scores here 565 is the single core score and 1612 is the multi-core score which you have in geekbench in my upcoming videos of this device i will try to take a look at the geekbench scores and then we'll try to compare these scores in which room you're having the better geekbench score and in another room what you are getting here of course i don't believe in these scores as you always say but still if you need this i will definitely try to include these things in the upcoming room reviews but right now this is what we have in this cherish os 565 etc etc the default camera which was a little bit not expected we have the miui camera pre-installed it looks quite good of course you have all these options available i tried checking out the portrait mode etc everything was working perfectly fine so that's one of the positive things about this one if you install this room and you don't want to root this this device or this custom room no worries safety status is passing here so yes you'll be able to use banking apps on your device without having any issues i tried checking out some banking apps and yes those were working perfectly fine so no issues here but if you want to root your device you can you can simply use the universal safety net fix magisk module and you're good to go other things if you check out the drm check a drm status which means l1 is there or not yes l1 is also present i haven't installed any kind of firmware so yes this also might be a very positive thing for you a lot of good things positive things are already included in this one settings ui has a bit of changes available in the past two or three versions we saw these changes but in the previous updates the changes were not like that but yes this is what we have about this update monet theming was expected it's there i tried checking out the wallpaper colors you have these options available which you have in the pixel launcher kind of things looking quite good a positive thing about this one and another things for example the battery section sound and vibration security we have the face lock we have the fingerprint lock we have the app lock all these things are available so that the thing is whichever thing you need everything is already present i don't think you need to root your device but yes if some customization is missing from here you can get all those customizations very easily with just the help of a module um i'll try to make a video on that one very soon we have the gestures option system navigation swipe to screenshot is also included things are looking quite interesting here which means we have the ota update also available we have new gaming modes available a lot more things are already here um bgmi seems to be good enough not 90 fps unlocked etc and now last but not the least some cherry show settings where you have some customizations customizations are just kind of same not going to talk about much about these things because this is what you have in almost all the custom rooms some things which i just want to let you know i have already shared with you these were things i just want to let you know link is in the description as always credits to the developers thanks for watching i will see you in the next video goodbye